This is Catholic Daily Reflections for Friday of the third week of Easter. Today's reflection is entitled, The Conviction of Jesus. The Jews quarreled among themselves, saying, How can this man give us his flesh to eat? Jesus said to them, Amen, amen, I say to you, unless you eat the flesh of the Son of Man and drink his blood, you do not have life within you. Certainly this passage reveals much about the Most Holy Eucharist, but it also reveals the strength of Jesus to speak the truth with clarity and conviction. Jesus was facing opposition and criticism. Some were upset and challenging his words. Most of us, when we find ourselves under the scrutiny and wrath of others, will back down. We will be tempted to be overly concerned about what others say about us and about the truth we may be criticized for. But Jesus did exactly the opposite. He did not give in to the criticism of others. It's inspiring to see that when Jesus was faced with the harsh words of others, he responded with even greater clarity and confidence. He took his statement about the Eucharist being his body and blood to the next level by saying, Amen, amen, I say to you, unless you eat the flesh of the Son of Man and drink his blood, you do not have life within you. This reveals a man of the utmost confidence, conviction, and strength. Of course, Jesus is God, so we should expect this from him. But nonetheless, it is inspiring and reveals the strength we are all called to have in this world. The world we live in is filled with opposition to the truth. It's opposed to many moral truths, but it's also opposed to many of the deeper spiritual truths. These deeper truths are things such as the beautiful truths of the Eucharist, the importance of daily prayer, humility, abandonment to God, putting God's will above all things, etc. We should be aware of the fact that the closer we grow to our Lord, the more we surrender to Him, and the more we proclaim His truth, the more we will feel the pressure of the world trying to steal us away. So what do we do? we learn from the strength and example of Jesus. Whenever we find ourselves put in a challenging position, or whenever we feel as though our faith is being attacked, we must deepen our resolve to be all the more faithful. This will make us stronger and turns those temptations we face into opportunities for grace. Reflect today upon the way that you react when your faith is challenged. Do you back down, give in to fear, and allow the challenges from others to affect you? Or do you strengthen your resolve when challenged and allow persecution to purify your faith? Choose to imitate the strength and conviction of our Lord, and you will become a greater visible instrument of His grace and mercy. Let us pray. Lord, give me the strength of your conviction. Give me clarity in my mission and help me to serve you unwaveringly in all things. May I never cower when faced with the challenges of life, but always deepen my resolve to serve you with all my heart. Jesus, I trust in you.